Hi, this is Colleen Barnhart of The Quilted Thistle, and today I am quilting dogwood flowers. This was a, an all-over edge-to-edge pattern that I came up with at the request of one of my clients, um, and I'm going to show you today how to st stitch it out as a continuous line design. So I've got these beautiful batiks, and they're a little bit dark, so I'm taking advantage of that to use this chalk pencil to kind of give me an idea of where I want to go. And I decided that I'm going to put the next dogwood flower here. So I kind of, you can might be able to see it, you might not, but I just chalked some four circles to give me a, a destination point. I'm going to start by traveling towards the flower and putting a leaf, and then I'll continue on from there. Once I've got that leaf in there, I'm going to go in fairly straight and I'm going to give myself the center of the dogwood. My drawn design had these a little bit larger, but this is the size that works to quilt the best. Now I'm going to go with my petals, one circle, two circles. three circles, and four, and then I'm going to give the outside edge its curled look by just going back around on the insides of each of those petals. Then I'm going to put the veins And by having these little circles at the middle of the flower, I can use those to trap the lines to travel. I'm using this beautiful purple glide thread. It's called lilac. The color is lilac. Now I'm gonna come back here and I, I'm gonna put a, a leaf in. And then I will start off on my next leaf to my next flower. And that's how I'm doing my dogwoods. Thanks.